Well, I, I think I think I have really good communication skills, and uh, and I am I'm, I'm pretty fis fiscally uh, conservative, if 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 you might say. Uh, with with that being said, is I'm not for uh, I'm not for saying no to everything. I am for for some progression with with the help with helping businesses do it. I think businesses can take us. We have to put trust in our people and our small businesses to take us forward. And I think they can. I really do. Uh, sometimes they may need a little help with with taxes and regulations. They need a little help. And I think we can make this place a very, very vibrant city. And I have a lot of hope uh, for the future of Owensboro. And I think it's going to be bright. I really do. I think uh, I think it's going to be uh, a vibrant city. We'll see once again. I think we're going to see us come back uh, as one of the top sports cities uh, in the state. I think we can re regain that. Uh, we've lost a little bit of that steam lately. I think we need to get that back. Uh, but with that being said, uh, I think my 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 skills of uh, listening to the people and doing the will of the people is is why I'm running for office and uh, that's why I would uh, uh, appreciate their vote and uh, hopefully they have trusted me that when I do listen to them I will take everything into account and make the best decisions possible for the city of Owensboro.